Hi, my name is Calcaria Kaap. My common name is middle layer of oyster cell. I proved by Dr. Honeyman. I am adapted to leukophlegmatic constitution. I am fair, fatty, flabby, who became easily fatigued and tired on walking with much sweating. I am adapted to those children who are fat, chalky look with red face, large belly like a inverted soccer with large head, open frontals and suture. I am a chilly patient disposed to catch cold very easily. I have scrofulous and tuberculous diathesis. I acted upon bones, gland, blood, skin, mind and female genital organs. I have great apprehension which became worse toward evening. Fear of darkness, loss of reason, misfortune, contagious and chronic disease. I have fear that I lose my reason or pupil will observe my mental confusion. I have restlessness of mind with gloomy mood and anxiety, peevish, always obstinate and self-willed. Slight mental effort produce heat. The least mental excitement cause profuse return of menstrual flow. I am timid and restlessness. I have sour taste in mouth with great thrust in the afternoon. Toothache only while eating. The toothache is aggravated by both heat and cold and in the evening. My stomach is swollen like an inverted soccer and is very painful to pressure. There is craving for undigestible things such as chalk, coal, pencil, salt, etc. I have great lodging for eggs especially either during sickness or conversions but has aversion to meat, fat, milk with disagree. Acidity of the digestive tract is very prominent. There is frequent sour irritation, sour vomiting and stool. I am very tired and overworked. There is complete loss of appetite with pain in the epigastrium which is very painful and tender to touch. I have aggravation by eating and by pressure. I am habitually constipated and I feel better in every way when constipated. However, there may also be occasional diarrhea, especially in children during the dentination period. The character of a stool is white and sour smelling. There is frequent sneezing without cold, dry coriza with much sneezing. I have painless hoarseness aggravated in the morning due to exposure to cold. I have sensation in the throat as if dust is in the throat as there is plug going up and down. Cuff is dry and tickling. Cuff in single paroxysm and the sputa is yellow in color. Exputation tastes sweet. The pieces of sputa are ejected as pieces of pus. I am excellent remedy for pre-tubercular condition for tubercular affection of lungs to tall, slender, rapidly growing young people. My menses is too early, too profuse, too long lasting with subsequent amenorrhea. The least mental excitement cause profuse return of menstrual flow. I also have leucorrhea which is milky white but acrid. Leucorrhea in young children too can be successfully treated by me. My bones are soft and weak and they develop very slowly. The bones are unable to hold the weight of the bulky flabby body and therefore often curvature of bones especially of spine and long bones occur. Often curvature of bones especially of spine and long bones occur. The extremities are crude, deformed and bones are irregularly developed. Since the bones are weak, there is late learning to work. The head is large and the frontals and sutures remain open with delayed ossification. 
teeth do not appear in time and consequently there is difficult and delayed dentination in children calcium and phosphorus are deficient in bones the baby sweats profusely and takes cold rarely as a consequence the sweat is well marked in the back of the head neck or chest and upper part of the body head sweats profusely while sleeping wetting the pillow far around the baby has tubercular dysthesis with enlarged gland the baby want to be magnetized i have great sensitiveness to take cold cannot tolerate cold and i also have sensitiveness to cold damp air and has great liability to take cold do you know sulfur has heat in patches but i am cold in patches and can says sweat also in patches i grow and cures polyp my babies are always more or less warmy and my babies always want to be magnetized my all discharges are sar example vomitus diarrhea sweat irritation sar in order i have aggravation from cold air wet weather cold water from washing in morning during full moon i get amelioration by lying on painful side and i am a chronic of belladonna and i should never be used before sulfur act best after sulfur and should not be repeated but in children it may be repeated in low potency